Okay, here we have our 2016 Vibe 250 with the front uh, Murphy bed and rear bunks. Take a quick look around the outside. On the front you've got the LP tanks with a power tongue jack. Over on the side here you can see the slide out. Got uh, stabilizer jacks. Down there you can see there's your drain point. Looks like that's a drain for a gray tank. Down underneath here we've got the low point lines. Back here we have another drain point. Looks like that's for the uh, bathroom with the gray water and the black water tanks. Right there's your power cord. Over here we've got city water fill and fresh water connections. You can fill the fresh water tank and take that with you. Over there is the back of the refrigerator vent. Down below the aluminum rims. On the back of the trailer, spare tire. Take a look overall. It's a sharp trailer and fiberglass. Coming around the corner here in the back corner is the outside kitchen feature. On the back here, on the back bumper, is a location to connect the outside grill, which is in the front compartment. I'll show you that in a moment. Here in the outside kitchen is the refrigerator. That's a 110 volt electric refrigerator with a small freezer in it. Sink, and this will retract for storage. Back into the trailer like that. Water heater, furnace exhaust, outside power ports, outside cable ports. You can bring the TV outside. And up above, we have an electric awning. As well as a pair of speakers on the outside. Then we come up to the front corner here. Inside the compartment is where that grill is located. And you can see here is the button for pushing or extending the jacks. So you got the front stabilizer jacks extend there. And the back stabilizer jacks extend with the button just underneath the back kitchen. Lend a hand grab handle. Triple step to get in. Come up in the camper. Light adjust. Up in front, we've got a sofa that will fold down, and then the whole whole bed will come down and make the height of bed or make the actual bed from there. The uh, Murphy bed feature. Up above, you can see the speakers and the TV antenna. The air conditioning is ducted into the roof. So you've got your central point where the cold air return, warm air return is. Over here is the dinette slide out. That will convert to a bed as well for additional sleeping. Behind the slide out is the entertainment area. Does not come with a TV, but you could add one there. Down below we do have a radio stereo system with DVD player. The kitchen is across from the dinette. Storage above. Big double sink, more storage below. There's a microwave and the stove with the oven. Then more storage behind that. Pantry style storage. The rear bunks in the back. The top bunk. And then the bottom bunk. And then your outside kitchen is right below that bottom bunk. Come around here. I have the refrigerator. So up here you have your on off, automatic versus gas. If you choose automatic mode, it will run on electricity until electricity is no longer present and it will switch to gas automatically. If you choose the gas mode, it will ignore the electric and just run on gas. Sorry about the focus there. So there's your inside of your freezer, the doorway, refrigerator door, and the refrigerator. Moving back into the bathroom, get a nice size shower with that rounded corner, the drawers shut, meat in the middle, and there's a travel latch for traveling. Inside the shower is a skylight, obviously hot and cold running water, and the shower head. There's also a ceiling fan, or vent with a fan in here, as well as the toilet. So the toilet is a foot flush. You press that down slightly to get water running through it, push it down further for the flushing feature. Then there is a vanity and a sink in the bathroom, and that's your GFI outlet. 
And then in just a moment, I will show you what that Murphy bed looks like made up. And there is the Murphy bed as a bed. With the bed folded down, you can see that the couch is folded down flat and the bed comes down on top of the couch. And then you have the bed there, as well as shirt wardrobes on either side of the bed for additional storage. So there'd be a hanging closet there for items like shirts and pants. And the other side. So a quick look around again. The bed is in the front. Slide out dinette. A little entertainment center there. Kitchen. In the back bunk room, bunks, and bathroom.